Welcome back. I'm so excited about this. I'm going to geek I out. I like him already. Yes. Ten years <laughs> after it opened on Broadway, Eric Idle, who wrote Spam a lot, is finally joining the cast at the Hollywood Bowl. And as his millions of fans know, if Eric Idle is in it, it's going to be hilarious. Yes. <laughs> I'm standing here in the middle of the Bollywood hole. Hi. Now what I mean. Now what I mean. Notch, notch. Now what I mean. Say no more. I don't like spam! Uh, don't make a fuss, dear. I love your spam. I love it. I'm having spam, 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 spam. But in this, the 127th upper class Twit of the Year show, yeah. Vivian oh, Smith Smy oh, Smith has O level in kennel hygiene. Money, money, money makes the world go money, 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 money. What do you do oh. with witches? Ah. Yes! yes. Big finish there. Look at that montage we put wow. together. Very nice you've montage. Been at this, uh, you've been doing this a few years. Yes, a few hundred years, a I think. It feels like anyway, years. yes. Spamalot has been a long time in the well, making. I mean, that was decades before you even created the show. Right. It's 10 years since we opened wow. uh, on Broadway and won the Tony for the best musical of the year with Spamalot. So, um, I saw it in New York. Did you? On Excellent. Broadway. Excellent. And I have to admit, I'm not a huge musical person, mm -hmm. so this was my way of sort of breaking it's in. A, it's a musical for people who don't like musicals. Exactly. Yes. No, no, it is. It's uh, very accessible for people. Oh my God, I laughed the whole day. It is such a great show. So you're going to be in it finally. Finally. Yes, I'm in it finally Why with a very good cast. Why did you decide to cast. finally do it? Well, it's only three nights. It's down the road from where I live. Yeah. Um, I love the Bollywood Hole. It's really fun. <laughs> uh, Bollywood Bowl. Oh, I'm so, so sorry. Yes, I'll learn it properly eventually. <laughs> And we have this fabulous cast, you know, we have Craig Robinson. From um, The Office. Yes, fame, Jesse, Jesse yeah. Tyler Ferguson. Modern Family. We've got Christian Slater. Wow. And uh, well, there he is. That's, that's Christian photobombing me and Warwick Davis. Wow. <laughs> so how long, um, I know sometimes when these things go on at the Hollywood Bowl, that you don't have a lot of time to prepare. It's great. We have 10 days to put <gasps> on the show. Stop no it. A way. whole musical, See, singing, dancing, like costumes. That's a show in and of itself. Yeah. It's like camp. Yes. It's like a camp. <laughs> you have a very unfair advantage because you wrote it. Yes. So you know it, yes. I would think. And I have the smallest part, as we say. There you go. <laughs> well, but it's how you right. use it, really. Right. There are no small parts in exactly. the show business. So um, for the rest of the cast, 10 days. The rest days, of them are fabulous. And they, yeah. But they, they're really having such fun. It's a joy to be with them. Can you believe the... I mean, I guess when you started doing all this Monty Python and the sketches, how long did it take? Because it still translates, mm -hmm. it still works. But when you first started out with this, when did you realize you had gold? Well, almost not till we'd finished, actually, because we didn't, we weren't popular in America until we'd finished doing the show in England. Wow. We, we, it was discovered in America much later, and uh, so luckily it didn't affect us. We were still sort of naive when we did the show. It's kind of good because then it doesn't it affect is. you creatively. Exactly. You're just kind of screwing around. Yes. Well, that's the thing though, the key that it translates because so many things come and go and they're not so memorable, but there's things like what you touch seems to work for years and years to come and it will. It, it's extraordinary. It shouldn't be. I mean, it's 40, <laughs> no, it really shouldn't be. It's 40 years since the Holy Grail opened, which is the movie Spamlot's based on. Right. And it's about 50 years since Python started. It's, I mean, it's a very long time and there are things I mean in the movie there, there are things I say almost on a daily basis like well the curtains yes I mean there's exactly. certain things that you just can't ever shake do you have a certain sketch or a certain line or character that like really stuck with you all these years I always love that line what the, it says one one day son all this can be yours well, the curtains. not the curtains lad <laughs> oh, but the, the, the funny thing is, so that was always the line that stuck out with a lot of people. Mm -hmm. But right before that, he looks at his father and he says, Mother. Father, lad. Yeah, oh, <laughs> father. It took me years to realize he said that because it got buried in the, okay, we're getting very inside. You, right? She's I'm a really huge, a huge, huge fan. Huge fan. Nerd with this Monty Python stuff. So. Well, that's great. That's yeah. lovely. I mean, I, I, I find it just amazing and it, it's just d delightful and thrilling that people still like it. And I'm impressed by this cast because they all can sing. Right. Who, who knew Craig Robinson had such a great voice? Okay. Yes, yes. I didn't and know Christian he was Slater a... sings. You know, it's amazing. Craig was a music teacher, I think, and I had no idea. He taught music back really? when he was oh, in Chicago. Really? She's a lovely and... voice. Yes. Beautiful voice. You have and... such a silly, fun cast. And yeah, I think that is the is. key. I myself, I have to admit, like Marie, I'm not a big musical person, mm -hmm. but because I'm not, I will enjoy it. Yeah, because like you said, it's for the non 
musical people. It is. It's a funny, silly show, and it works. It always mm -hmm. works. I've seen it around the world. Can so we still get tickets to Hollywood Bowl? You can still or, get Hollywood tickets. Hall? Yes, you Hollywood. can get tickets to the Bollywood Hall. Oh, good. And um, please come along because it's um, it's going to be three fun nights. All right. What a great place to see it. Thank you so Thank much. You it's so good in. to meet you. <laughs> Very yeah. nice to meet you. Hope I didn't scare you away. So no. spam a lot at the Bollywood Hall. <laughs> there will be three performances Friday, July 31st, Saturday, August 1st, and Sunday, August 2nd. You know how it is there? You pack a picnic basket, oh, yeah. you go. It'll be a great time. Thank you so much.